me again, guys. Let me edit my Patreon first. It is still raining here. As of now. As of now. I would stop Mr. Money and Life from broadcasting. Now we can start. <laughs> Good afternoon again, Money and Life Movement. Welcome back to my channel and welcome again to JJ's Random Thoughts Live. Hey, I'm still here in Coffee, Coffee Bean and Tea Leaf, Southwood Small. It's a really clean place. It's a really ambient place. I strongly suggest if you're if you're living if you're living near some you take a snack here and well just relax right just relax you can even do you can even do business here right if you're if you have an online business you do you do business here it's a very relaxing place so what is the burning question we have what burning question do i have for you now here it is if you're a network marketer should you should you meet your prospects well something like this a coffee shop hmm let's answer that this afternoon shall we well before we actually answer that question i'm gonna i'm gonna leave a message for uh for those uh for the free crowd okay for the non-patreon for my non-patreon audience okay? Click that, you click, click that thing over there, right? Or right here. And I'm, I'm, I'm rather disoriented right now. <laughs> Just click subscribe and the bell to stay in the loop regarding my channel, especially uh, especially episodes of this show. Thank you. Ah, ito ba? Pwede umingin na lang ng ano, ng tap water palagi mo. Tamat! I just had my just had my snack cleaned up and I was requesting for water. <laughs> okay, so where was I? If you're on Patreon, or if you're not yet on Patreon, over head on over to Patreon and search for me. Become a patron of mine. If and only if you want to see an episode of this show live. All right. So I've been doing this since episode twenty nine. Episode twenty nine was actually my first since episode three right when youtube was still allowing uh creators having 100 or less subscribers to, to use their to use the youtube app to do live streaming right i'm coming from my laptop <laughs> oh thank you Ay, pwede na tap water lang. no ice please thank you Bibigyan ako ng yellow. <laughs> so by, by the time i'm done with this episode my sore throat now <laughs> I got a sore throat already. Okay, on to our burning question. If you're a network marketer, should you meet with your prospect inside a coffee shop? Well, my answer is depends. Oh, thank you so much, thank you. Remember the name. Hmm? Coffee bean and tea. Hey. And the, uh, the the staff here are very friendly. And you got very friendly staff here. So, <clears throat> para, para ko nasa bahay lang. <laughs> okay, my answer is depends. Now, if you're, uh, if the purpose of your meetup with the prospect is for a uh, coaching or consulting call like me, I would meet them here. Okay. The coffee shop is the most relaxing environment. Known. All right. If you're if you're on a mentoring, coaching, or consulting call, or any uh, or any appointment of that nature, meet them in a place like this. All right. Meet them in a place like this. But. If your if the if the purpose of the meetup is a sign is a sign up, okay? If it's a sign up appointment, do not meet them in a place like this. 
Okay. Why? Because you're lower, because right there and then you are lowering the value of your prospect or your, uh, or your uh, sign up candidate, so to speak. You're probably asking, JK, why am I, why is, uh, why is it lowering the value of the prospect? Well, it's a sign up appointment for God's sakes. Okay. Your prospect will be paying thousands, pay, paying thousands, if not not tens of thousands of uh, mula, right? Uh, in, in local currency, it's pesos or, well, tens of thousands, okay? They'll be paying a huge sum of money to you just to become a member of your team. So what better way to add value to that prospect is then uh, then to meet them at least in a hotel lobby for the sign up proceedings. After all, it's any you know any any hotel you know that has a that has a noisy lobby. <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think so. So. It projects a hotel lobby can project uh, can project a lot of professionalism. Okay, so that's why I strongly suggest that you meet your prospect for a sign. You do your sign up appointments in a hotel lobby at least. All right, you don't have to meet them in a hotel restaurant or a fancy restaurant that's connected to a hotel. Just the hotel lobby is fine. Right, it already projects. Uh, it already projects to the prospect that you mean business and that your profession and that your uh, that you have a professional ma you have a professional way of doing your doing uh, doing this kind of business, right? They know that they'll they know that the culture is uh, the culture is not cheap. Okay, you're not promoting a cheap culture inside your group, and um they won't they probably they probably won't be intimidated by uh by what you want what you want to happen in the group okay. now if it's for product sales well coffee shop is fine coffee shop is fine you can even treat them to a uh, you can even treat them to to free coffee as a thank you gift okay but if the aim of the appointment is a sign up. Okay? If you aim for the prospect uh, signing up under you, you have to meet them inside a, a hotel lobby, right? It's the best. It's the best venue for a sign up appointment. Even in a ordinary sales appointment, like uh, when I was doing sales, when I was uh, when I was when I was a salesman, I would insist on my prospect to. Uh, to meet up in, in in a hotel somewhere to finalize to finalize his uh, to put his to make him put his signature on that on, on that contract or like uh, when I was selling insurance it's the best it's the best app it's the best venue to uh, to have the prospect sign that contract okay so as always if it's a random thought or discussion so i'll be uh, you're gonna make me a very happy man if you comment if you comment down below right now about this episode share your thoughts your opinions and i'd love to engage with you right you comment as you comment below you're gonna make me a very happy man all right <laughs> i'm more I'm, I'm i'm a comment guy than a like guy okay so I uh, I put to me comments are more expensive all right comments have more value than likes so I would love to hear your thoughts comment below now all right and if you haven't subscribed and hit the bell for for those non patreon users you do it now if you're not on patreon yet and if you want to see me do an episode live 
go to pay you go you go to my patreon and become one of my patrons so again from coffee bean from coffee bean and tea leaf southwoods mall <laughs> i'm gonna lost for words now